Hi, it's Goxie here, um, coming to the end of 2016, so I'm doing my wrap-ups of the year, and my next subject is one that's really close to my heart, uh, metaphorically and literally, is food. Um, it was a huge year, 2016, in food. Uh, Red Rooster started delivering. Um, this was huge. This was a game-changer. It, it changed everything, because uh, now you can have uh, fine fine dining, high quality cuisine in the comfort of your own home without even leaving. And um, if you spill a bit of gravy, you, you can quickly take your shirt to the to the laundry, which is good because uh, most, of, most of my shirts in my wardrobe have some gravy stains on it, but um, not, you know, I reckon we can all admit <laughs> a bit of, anyway, there was the shapes controversy. That was huge. Um, a lot of people, this got a lot of people worked up, really upset about the shapes changing the flavour. Uh, it was interesting to see just how angry people were as well because um, I, don't, I, didn't, I didn't even see as much anger about uh, the government sort of, uh, you know, human rights abuse and stuff. But, um, nah, good on your government. Uh, you're all right. Nah, that's not true. I don't like the government. But, uh and then uh, they finally caved in, you know. I, see, I can't, I don't know what's worse, like changing it or like not even sticking to your guns, you know. At least stick to your guns, you know. But um, KFC had a few a few different things. Um, I'll, look, I'll admit, I don't, I don't get along to KFC as much as I, I would like to because I, I, I really think it's a nice family experience, but I don't, I haven't been able to take my kids along because there's no playgrounds at KFC. I don't know. Does anyone know why? Does anyone know why there's no playgrounds at KFC? If if they had if they had playgrounds at KFC, I think I'd it'd move up from four star to five star restaurant for me. The fact like some people think I'm on on Tinder, but I'm not actually. I'm just wiping the potato and gravy off my phone, so um, that's what that is. I'm not actually swiping. Anyway, uh, that's it. That's my wrap up for the year. Uh, Twenty seventeen. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. I hope uh, people can push the boundaries of food, see where we can take it. Uh, Cause as I always say, um, uh, you can't beat a top feed. Thanks for watching my wrap up. See ya.